Yo, yo, everybody, I'm Michael, and this is going to be the bonus game of Spirit of Revenge vs. Castle. Uh, it's probably going to take me two videos to get through the bonus game. It might take one if I'm really, really good at solving puzzles, but I'm not always the greatest at solving puzzles. Uh, to get to the bonus game, just select bonus right here on the title screen. And I should note that the bonus game is only available if you're playing the Collector's Edition. So it's not in the Standard Edition of the game. The standard Edition of the game just ends with, with the previous video. Inspector, did you see that? See what? The, the evil... Whoa. Are you alright? I'll go get her. Don't worry, we'll get you out of there. Okay, Inspector Incredibly Helpful is here to help save the day. Oh, that's not good. I couldn't stop you in the castle, but now you'll be forever cursed to wander its ghostly halls. The evil I created while I was alive is keeping me here. It was the dark half of my soul that abducted you. I'm very weak, but I'll try to help you. Okay, so Lord... whatever his name was. David? Apparently, he, his ghosts, he's got half evil and half good. Why can't it be over? I've always been against sequels to happy endings, and now look! Don't you hate it when, you know, your, your movie has a happy ending or your book, and then they just make a sequel or bad things happen, and, and the happily ever after is ruined? Or, or even worse, like, the, the character kind of has a, like, you know, they change their life around, and then they just ruin their life and go back to what they were doing, you, you know, previously. <laughs> I, I, you know, I hate to use, like, Star Wars as an example, but man, Han Solo had a happy ever after, he had a wife and, and a kid, and he was great, and then and then in the sequel, he he's just back to uh, being a smuggler, you know, like he was 30, 40 years ago. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Of course, Princess Leia is also back to being, like, a rebellion leader like she was 30, 40 years ago. I guess they're both, like, trying to recapture their lost youth. I'm like, no, no, I wanted them to be happy and move on with their lives and, instead of being all sad and stuff. Anyway, uh, we're in the catacombs, we're in the catacombs. And uh, one of the cool things about this bonus game is that it's different. You know, a lot of games when they have a, like a bonus game, we have to revisit uh, a lot of scenes from the main game. But no, this is all 100% brand new material. I like it. I kind of wish more games were, were like that, and, you know, add new unique material for the bonus game, so this is cool. Oh, hey, it's the Evil Queen from Snow White. Hi. Okay, so it looks like I'm doing pretty well with solving puzzles. I guess what I have to do is distract myself by talking about Star Wars, and that's how I uh, stay on target. Stay on target, yes. Okay, so we're going to break these crystals here, uh, and we need to solve a puzzle with both of these statues. I love the way this statue looks. This statue could not care less. Um, yeah, that statue is silently judging me. Uh, yeah, we need to solve a puzzle with both statues. And that will open up the door. Let's see, this one needs a bracelet. I wonder if these are statues of something that I'm supposed to recognize. Hmm. Anyway, this is going to be a puzzle. Just throw our items here and follow the instructions here. So we smash the crystal. We pour the white stuff. We spin it, spin it to win it, and then light this up. And this lights up the room. Right? Oh, it lights up the candles. That's nice. And hey, guess what? <laughs> We have a giant evil mole, apparently. Okay, so what what do I need to find in this room? Oh, there's a cat! Why was there a Oh, the cat gave us a hidden objects challenge! That's a random cat from out of nowhere giving us hidden objects challenges. What can I say? Right, I believe... 
those are the only two things. The flatware and the crown are the only ones you have to, like, work to get. And then everything else, we just click on it to find it. Okay, so I need a paper boat and an egg and an animal print and a bracelet. And it looks like I need a tusk and a candle and a paper boat. A paper boat. Um, a candle. I'm going to use a hint for the tusk. Okay. Whoa, 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 hold on a second. That is the Cave of Wonders from Aladdin. I've seen that movie, sir. This is the Cave of Wonders. Only the diamond in the rough may enter. Okay, so I solved both puzzles here. To open this doorway. Okay, and I think I have to go back and forth between here and the diamond in the rough before I can... can whoa, what? I've been a fool letting anger rule my actions. Now I realize what's really important, and that's to be with my family. Aww. But my dark side has taken over. It keeps me trapped here. Please, find my treasury. It holds the key to my salvation. Trapped by the dark side of the forest. Oh my goodness. Okay, so... Yep, I'm trapped. Okay, so let's sum up. If he can be redeemed, we need to help the good half defeat the evil half by trapping the evil half in some sort of crystal. Okay, this thing is stuck here. Obviously, it's going to match with that token. Um, we're going to need two tokens to open up you, lady. And this is... We're going to need two birds for this. Okay, back to the Cave of Wonders, everyone. Cave of Wonders. What are we doing? This is... Uh-oh. Danger! Danger! Over here. Solve the puzzle to keep going. Don't even try to escape. You're trapped here forever! Yep. Okay, so, uh, obviously we're gonna put this here. This is kinda cool. It's like a labyrinth minotaur room. So we're gonna need the labyrinth thing here. And, like I said, we're gonna need the other part of the phoenix token. Okay, so hint, what am I supposed to do? Aha, there's a pickaxe. I still have no idea what I'm supposed to do. What do I destroy with the pickaxe? Okay, obviously I put this token here, but that's not going to do anything. Pickaxe here. Right, great, right. That's it. That makes sense. Okay, so that gives me the flame token, and now we go back. Like I said, we kind of go back and forth between these two rooms. This puzzle. Okay, so this puzzle, what you want to do is move the uh, little piece around, and it cannot be adjacent to a flame. If it's adjacent to a flame, uh, that's bad. That's really, really bad. So I'm going to do this. I'm going to try to get flames, uh, you know, like here in this area that's safe because the flower's not going back there. Okay, so you sort of have to do the puzzle like that. Like, very carefully move flames out of the way. Hmm, see, I think I've already made a mistake here. Okay. Yeah, there we go. Okay, so now what we do is just move all these flames over and above, around like that. Move this right one, move over and around, sort of like I was doing. And that's what you do in order to solve the puzzle. Uh, I'm not going to solve the puzzle, though, because that's going to take forever. More evil. Okay, more evil. There's the nymph's flower, and here's a hidden objects challenge. Okay, let me see. We want to light the candle. And we have the lamp in the Cave of Wonders. I knew it. I knew it. I knew it was here. Yeah, you don't really have to aim with this puzzle. The game makes you think you have to, but you kind of don't. Just drag it anywhere on the board and the game will accept it. Pieces in 
place gives us the raven. What is in the roots? It's a puzzle! Okay, I think I can solve this. So with this puzzle you want to click on the various uh, flowers in the correct order. Whatever that order may be. Looks like the order might be a bit random. Oh, come on, one, two, three, four, five, six. Yay. Be nicer to me this time, game. Yes. Okay, we still are not close to solving this puzzle. This is going to be kind of a tough puzzle. Okay, so we need to find gems. A uh, bunch of gems hidden on the screen. Okay, but we still need the, the instructions on how to arrange the gems. Can we look at any of these statues? Nope. Okay, I guess we can't. And we're going back here. We're going to put this on the nymph. Okay, now that both tokens are on the nymph, we have a puzzle. We need to find bird tokens, and unless I'm mistaken, this will give us the final bird token. Final slash second bird token necessary to open the door. birds. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. Uh, hint. Be my savior. One left. Left side of the screen. No birds to be seen. Must be over here on the right. Fight. Fight. Nope. I'm not, I'm not seeing any birds. Unless this random... No, that's a gargoyle statue. That's cool. I like the cool-looking gargoyle statues. I just don't... Don't... Don't know why they went with gargoyle statues. Hmm. This place is so amazing. Oh, yeah. I haven't really looked at this at all. Um... In the game. Yeah. Hmm. Well, the only way to free myself is to free the evil... Uh, free... Free the good side. Yes, I was totally right. Okay, so let's put these two birds in place. <gasps> this puzzle. Okay, um... Okay, yeah, let's see. So what you want to do is move the pieces around to put them all into place. So, purple, yellow, and then this is purple yellow green here right so is there ever a purple yellow green no so let me turn it this way is there ever a green yellow purple yes there is right here and so i would do things like that to figure out where the pieces go so this is let's see this is what is this okay purple green green okay purple surrounded by two greens that's here Beautiful. And then this is purple with yellow, yellow, obviously in that corner. Okay, so what's this? This is going to be yellow, yellow, no, purple, purple, yellow. Don't rush me, game. I'm almost finished with this. So this is going to be that lone yellow. Um, okay, so this is going to be purple. Okay, so this is purple, yellow. Not quite sure which direction that purple, yellow is going to be. This is purple... I must have messed up somewhere. Okay, never mind. Thank you for rushing me, game. <laughs> wow, I could bathe in gold. This guy must have had a heart attack after seeing all these riches. I think I might be... Let's take a look at the map and see where we are. Okay, it looks like we've solved about half of the rooms here. Yeah, we're about halfway through this uh, bonus game. So I'm going to stop here. In the next video, we'll finish it.